No, but I won't hesitate no more, no more. This cannot wait. I'm sure there's no need to complicate. No, our time is short. This is. Hey folks, it's Bob and Cameron here at the Al McGinnis Sports Center for anticipating the big announcement from TSN and the, the uh, top ten. Cameron, what's this all about? Craft uh, celebration tour. Uh, we are hoping we're waiting the announcement. We're hoping the good news is going to be that uh, Portland is going to be part of the craft celebration tour. The final stop is the final announcement to uh, complete the tour. They got five dates out east, five dates out west, and uh, we're hoping to have the TSN crew here along with twenty-five thousand dollars. And seriously, are you hoping for the TSN crew or just one crew member? One crew member. And that crew member is? Kate Burnett. And what will you be saying to Kate if you see her here in Porto? Will you marry me? And she will say? Yes. <laughs> The dream continues. You can see in the background some of the folks who have gathered here in Fort Hood. TSS on the big screen, and we'll bring it to you here on YouTube with 101.5 The Hot. Our time is short. This is our thing. I'm yours. No, I won't hesitate. No more. No more. This cannot wait. There's no need to complicate our time is short. This is our fate. I'm your
uh, Cameron McCachran here, and uh, as we just heard, Port Hood is the final stop in the Craft Celebration Tour. And uh, right now I'm joined by uh, Jenna Chisholm. And Jenna, um, a lot of work went into, you know, organizing uh, the, the rally, you know, a couple weeks ago, also uh, tonight here at the Alameda Sports Center. What does this mean to you, for someone who's been so involved in, in the organization of all this, uh, what does this announcement meant to you so far? It's huge, it's inspiring, it almost brings a tear to your eye instantly, because it's like, you know, we're, we're Port Hood, we're not a huge community by no means compared to, you know, even Alberta, NBC, the small small town communities that they have there. Um, it's huge to have a community of about 1,500 people win an award like this and get national, you know, television coverage and 25 grand, like that's huge, that's a lot of money, so. Um, we're, it's going to go towards operational costs, like the boiler system needs to be repaired and the air exchange system needs to be repaired. So for the rank to get that, that's that's huge. And for Port Hood to get a chance to get TSN to come down here, it's, it's going to be amazing. Yeah, so $25,000, of course, for, for upgrades and that kind of thing, and then the uh, TSN Sports Center broadcast. Port Hood's really shown their mettle over the years with, with this kind of thing. You know, Mitch McDonald, of course, who performed this evening, yep. he, he went right to the uh, final two at Canadian Idol. And now this, what can you say about the community's uh, support for these, this kind of thing? Uh, I think it says a lot about Port Hood that when, you know, we have something that comes to us, Port Hood really goes after it. So any community, I think, in Inverness County really goes after it. But Port Hood's showing now with Canadian Idol and now the TSN that, you know, you put us in a competition, <laughs> we're going to play. <laughs> Thank you, Jenna, and congratulations. Thank you very much, Cameron. You There's a reason that I love 